Hello and welcome. My name is Amulli and in this video I'm going to show you how to install Django on Microsoft Windows 10. So to have Django installed on your system you need to have Python installed. So to download and install Python you simply go to python.org slash download and hit on this yellow download button and run the installation wizard once you have python installed go ahead and launch your command prompt powershell is not fully compatible with django so you got to run command prompt so now we will go ahead and check the python version which is 3.7.2 on my system we also have pip installed with python so let's go ahead and check the version which is this which is supposed to be the latest one so we have everything latest now to install django on microsoft windows or any other operating system it's recommended to have a virtual environment installed and activated on your system so we will go ahead and install virtual environment and then create a virtual environment on the system activate it and then install Django within that virtual environment so let's go ahead and do that so we will use this is basically a Python package so to install a Python package we run this command pip and then ring install then the name of the package in this case it's virtual env and that's wrapper and then win win that's for windows so hit enter and successfully installed now we need to create a virtual environment so you do not need to change the directory here you simply type mk virtual env you can get all these commands on this page i will leave this link in the description area so here you see this is what we have typed now so make virtual env then the name of the environment this is completely up to you what you want to name it so i'm going to keep it very short dj env and then hit enter this is the part where base profile is this is python base profile executable here you can see it's creating the virtual environment for us this helps you when you're going to deploy your Django application on the web for the world at the moment at the moment it's installing the packages so setup tools pip and wheel you would say pip is already installed but it's just trying to up uh, install in this environment almost done and it's it's done so now once you have your virtual environment created uh, you you get into virtual environment when you create it but next time when you launch the terminal you will have to activate the virtual environment every time you want to get into the project and do whatever stuff you want to do so to activate it you simply type work on and the name of the environment so dj and b that's name for my environment and once you have this environment in braces that means you are in that environment and it's been activated so once you are in the environment you can go ahead and install the Django so pip install Django 
and this is going to install the latest Django at the moment you're going to run this command. Most important thing every time you have to activate the virtual environment for your project Django project and to do so you simply type work on and the name of the environment whatever name you have given and we are almost done here Pits in Django just to Alrighty, so Django has been already installed. You can see it's 2.1.7 with PIDs. So let's go ahead and list all the packages that we have installed. So this is going to list all the packages Django, PIP, PIDs, and setup tools. We have Wheel as well. Now we can go ahead and create a Django project in this environment. So we simply type Django admin and this is a command that start project to create a new project basically and then you give name of the project so my app and hit enter. This project already already exists so we will create another project so let's say one so this has been created now we will change the directory so cd my app one and then hit enter clear the screen then we are quickly going to run the server so simply say python and then manage dot pi run server okay so now we can go ahead and visit this url which is localhost colon 8000 oh it's taking a bit longer i don't know why It's 8,000. Perfect. Django. Here we go. This time it's taking a bit longer. I don't know why. Django app doesn't take this long. I'm quickly going to run it again. Oh, we have here we have. So that's it for this video. I hope you are able to install the Django on your Microsoft Windows system. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Have a good day. Bye for now.